Hello and welcome to my channel. I've been wanting to do a movie night at my local lodge for a while, uh, but the old projector broke. So I have to buy a new one. Um, I have to buy it for cheap. And it's got to be bright enough because you'll see later. One side of the lodge is uh, entirely windows. There's a ton of background light. I need to find the right projector at the right price that I can have this movie night and I need to be able to install it fairly inexpensively. Can I do it? Let's find out. Okay, I took a gamble on this. I don't know if it's any good. The reviews were pretty good on Amazon. I needed something fast and cheap. So I've already got uh, 1H to video. I've got my AC power cord. Got my HDMI. Got a remote. And what? Oh, screen cleaner? <gasps> okay, that's it for that. Oh, comes with a simple projection screen, which I was not counting on. Uh, cool. I might set that up later. This is what I needed. Because in order to make the ceiling mount, I need this little guy here. Okay, it's got some weight to it, so that's a good sign. Got connectors for headphones, AV, uh, TF would be something, HDMI, USB, VGA, which is fantastic. I wish I knew that before I ordered because I have a VGA cable already running there. And I bought a super long HDMI cable. But uh, something tells me might not be a bad time to upgrade. So let's get this thing installed and see how it works. Well, wait just a minute. Floating head here. YouTube says I need to entertain you and uh, time lapses aren't very entertaining. So what do we do about that? I have a secret weapon. It's called a Victrola. Top of the line technology for Edwardian culture and old timey music. Here we go. One minute.
I have to do a lot of complicated wiring, at least it's complicated to me. Um, that VGA cable from the old one won't reach there, so I have to do HDMI all the way back to the control room. And hopefully I got the right length because HDMI is expensive compared to VG VGA. <sighs> Speakers, all that stuff, I think should still be all set. Um, I have to rehang half of this stuff because of course I zip tied it all together. So power cable has to come down, all those zip ties have to come down and I have to rehang a bunch of stuff all on this ladder that may not last much longer and I'm getting really nervous about it. Um, I don't know if you can see just the uh, nails and whatnot that are popping out. Yeah, I really should not be standing on this, but well, see, maybe I'll uh, land gracefully, I don't know. Okay, we can at least test it now. It's better than before. Okay, so, looks like the keystone will only adjust so much, so the image is going to be skewed for a little while. I think I can lower the platform a little bit, um, but that might have to wait until another day. It's at least working right now, uh, at least turning on and functioning. I'm going to have to play around with it a little bit and just see if I can make it at least show a movie or something. Just had to pay the ADHD tax because I forgot the most important thing that I was supposed to bring on this trip. And so I was halfway there, had to turn around, come back. That's what I get. Okay, I'm back for round two. Uh, I have to extend the uh, cable both cables all the way over to that little office enclosure over there and then lower that thing so it's more in line with the screen and then I think we're done let's see how far I get Okay, so what's the verdict here? I uh, ooh, look like I just rolled out of bed. The projector works great. Um, it's mounted about eight feet away from the screen and uh, I would love to get a bigger picture. I'm gonna try to move it back another time and just see how it does like 12 feet away from the screen. And um, yeah, maybe it's gonna get blurry and maybe it won't be worth it and uh, maybe it'll work just fine. But at least we've got maybe a, you know, four foot by six foot picture and it's good enough for now. Uh, the picture works fine, the audio, I tested that before, that works fine. I think you heard the crackling fireplace. Um, we're gonna do a movie screening here 
uh, in another couple weeks and see how that goes. But I'm excited uh, all in all. I think this projector is a uh, solid B+. It's doing pretty good, uh, especially for the price. Um, it's pretty high output as far as lumens goes. I wasn't able to find anything brighter than this for that price point. So I'm pretty happy. I would say if you want a good projector for cheap, go for it. <laughs> Just ridiculous. <laughs>